Again, Mark Wilson, your man here at NASCAR. Thanks for tuning in. I wanted to cover lubing the bushings. Extremely important when your cart is creaking. It may not be a broken bushing. It could be as much as needing some WD-40. And let me show you how this works. Very simple. I like the hose because you can get in and out and there's some areas where it's extremely tough. Like the EasyGo RXZ that we have here, you notice these are A-arms. There's bushings here, bushings on the rear, and even bushings back here. Also, this strut tower has bushings as well. So where my fingers are at up top, we're gonna open the wheel and you can keep the camera there. Watch, watch how. There's gonna be your bushings right there. And then up top here, where my finger's at, in the top of the shock tower, you will see bushings. So what you wanna do is just squirt some WD-40 in this area. And then we're gonna come down here. And then we go all the way in the back here. As you can see those bushings as well. Very important to everybody. These two sides need to be lubed accordingly. And when you drive it around for 100 yards, rock the cart back and forth, lube, drive, wash that lube inside of those bushings, you'll be just fine. And also the rear bushings here, and I'll show you a close-up picture of what we're going to lube up, is the rear leaf springs. The EasyGo RXD has rear leaf springs. This is a single ply rear leaf spring. As you can see, there's a bushing in here with the bushing tube. And then what we would do is we would lube that in there. And you can see how it just soaks right in there. And then it will drive all the way down. Now, when we put new bushings in, our friends at Red Hawk supply us with bushings. Here's your bushing tube. And here's your larger bushings. And then you'll be putting them in there. This is extremely important to even put dielectric grease in here that you see so that when you push in these bushings, they go in much easier. Everybody, this is very important to understand. Lube your bushings so that you can take away the creakiness. We have episode three as far as how to grease the rear end as far as creakiness go away. Your man at NASCARs. Have a great day.